Hello, how are you? I'm back again, ladies. Mama Roxy back at you again with a couple of more products I found today at Walmart. I am having a visitor pop in. Say hi. hi. <laughs> That's my grandson. And he has got to pop in, y'all, whenever he can. I'm telling you, he is my busy man. But anyway, I'll be back, ladies. Go, go, go. All right, my ladies, I'm back. I'm sorry. I went to Walmart today. You know I've been to TJ Maxx earlier. I went to Walmart. I got me some Milani. You see it? And it's called uh, You Pink Swear. Pink, you, you Pink Swear. And it's number 03A. Can you see it? I have it right here. I don't mean to be giving y'all the finger. But it's such a pretty bubblegum color to me. It goes on nice. Uh, this one, I got this one as well. And this one you can see. Let me see. It's right here. I'm giving you the finger again. Can you see that? That's very pretty. Um, and it's called the Vanilla Almond. 29A. That's the that's the number and the name. And I got it from Walmart. I paid like a dollar fifty for it. And I like Milani uh products. I really do. They go on nice. Um they real smooth. I got me two lip glosses as well. And they don't have any names on them, ladies. I am so sorry. But they are lip glosses, and I paid a dollar for them. They were on sale today. I'm, I'm really getting into Milani products because I hear so much about Milani, a lot about their uh, blushes and their uh, palettes, little, little quads they have. And I hear a lot about the lipsticks, I love the packaging of the lipstick. But when I go to Walmart, um, TJ Maxx, or other little places where I go, they never have Milani lipsticks. And I stay in a little small town, so it's very hard to get those, but I love the packaging. I'm going to go on Amazon and check them out too. So this is like a peachy color. Uh, a pretty peach. Can you see it? It's a pretty peachy color. It goes on. It's not sticky. It's a nice spread of little product. It smells good, y'all. You know how you make cake? I'm a cake baker. I make cakes all year round, honey. And this is what this smells like. It smells like some some sweet cake batter. That's what it tells. That's what it smells like. And it got a little sweet taste to it as well. I like that. You know I like that. <laughs> okay, and this one right here, this is a deep color. Um, more like a red. Can you see it? It's coming out like a little orangey color on the screen. But it's not. It's a, it's a pretty red color. And it's a deep red. From the nights that I go out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look at that. I have two pretty colors from Milani. Those are the only two things that I was able to find today. I buy a lot of Milani nail polish. That's why I got it today. But Milani, the bubble gum. I like call it bubble gum. But it's called You Pink Square. <laughs> And this one is Vanilla Almond 29A. I'm telling you, I like the way they went on. They went on very smooth. And my lips are pretty, right? I know. <laughs> but as I speak, I also went and purchased some Wet n Wild. Y'all know I try to open these products. And this lipstick is a Fusion Blue Pearl. And it's like a pretty purple and it's like some pink in there and everything. Ladies, I promise you, 
I might have to get something to open them up because they're so hard to open. Good Lord. Y'all don't do what I do and stab yourself. Please don't. But it is so hard to open. I swear it is. Hold on, ladies. I got it. I spend most of my time opening stuff. That's why I be trying to. Uh, but I want y'all to know that I be done just received a product or got a product or bought it. And that's why I have it like that. Okay, this one right here. I want you to see it. Can you see that? I love that. My little grandson walked out with my towel. Oh, look at that. That's wet and wow. Look at that's like a pretty purple. Honey, I'm telling you. It looked like it got like two or three different colors in it. And you had to make sure you turn around right because I hate to mess up my products. Okay, that's one wet and wow. And that's a pretty fuchsia. Okay, and I have another wet and wow, which is this pretty color right here. Oh, that was easy. I did this earlier. <laughs> now look at that color. That's pretty. Y'all know this is my favorite color. I love me some pink. Oh, this would be nice. Look at that. Right here. That is very pretty. I love that. And I like the little, the way it looks expensive in the little bottle that it's in. The little container. And this is called Pink Ice. Mm. Mm. All right, now this one right here, ladies. This one is uh, Breezy. Breezy something. It's called Breezy. And, oh, wow. It looks very pretty. Can you see that? What in wow is coming up with some beautiful products. I'm swatching it right up under the pink, and it's lighter. Can you see it? It got a nice little glisten to it. It's real smooth. I like the way the packaging look. It makes it look like you have some expensive products when you buy them like that. Honey, you know I got hickle this product again. <laughs> it gives me hell trying to open them up. But that's okay. I got it. Look. Okay, now this is a new one. This looks like a coral and this is What's up, Doc? Check the name out. What's up, Doc? I'm going to swatch this right above. All right. Look at that. Right here. That's gorgeous. Ladies, it's all about the lips with me lately. You know what I'm saying? I enjoy buying the Wet and Wild products. I enjoy them very much. And this one is a darker one. And this one is uh, dark wine. Look. I'm versatile in trying new things. I like to try new colors. I like to see how they blend with my skin. These products come from uh, Walmart. And I paid like $1.50 for each little tube of lipstick, the Wet and Wild. Um... NYX, they had a sale on these, on NYC's, and I paid like a dollar, like 89 cent for these. I told you ladies, I am for your wallets, your wallets, your purses, and your pocketbooks. And remember, I have to show you this before I go. I have so many to show you, and I'm trying to show them all to you. If not, it would be a second thing to this, this video. This one right here... Is an NYC product. You ladies know I have such a hard time. Again, trying to get into this. I don't have... I'm trying not to tear, break my fingernails all up, ladies. But I should have had my sons come do this for me. But it's coming along. It's coming. It's coming. And this one right here, I can't wait to show you the inside of it. Because it is pure D gorgeous. 
Y'all, it has a apple. An apple on the inside of it, ladies. Oh, my goodness. I'm, I can't wait to see what it tastes like. You know, I'm into tasting because I like to kiss. So, <laughs> look. Can you see it? Can you see the little apple? Isn't that pretty? Yes, this is NYC and it's called Applelicious. And it's a bomb. Brilliant. That's what it's called. And it's $3.53. And it's called Pink Lady. Yes, $3.53. I wonder what you look like. This is more like a lip balm, baby. And it's pretty. Got a little moisturizer in the middle. You see that? I love it. I love it, NYC. I got some more. Look at this. It's shaped like a bullet. I'm liking this as well because it reminds me of one of their MAC products. And they know products is shaped like a bullet. But theirs is all black. But, like I said, I like to look like I've paid a lot of money for, I'm tearing my nails up. I like to look like I paid a lot of money for my products. So just in case I don't finish today, I am coming back with you with another video about my lipsticks that I purchased today. So my ladies, I'm here for your wallets, your purses, and your pocketbooks, baby. And don't forget the heart. I love you guys. I'm coming back with, um, I got one, two, oh, hold on, three, four, five more lipsticks that I want to uh, swab for you guys. But I have to run out right now and I will be back before my video shuts off. I love you guys very, very much. My equipment is terrible. But I'm coming up every day. I'm getting better and better with everything. And I had a couple of ladies ask me how I was doing. I'm feeling a whole lot better, you ladies. And I am so thankful that uh, you guys care enough to subscribe to me and come check out my channel with me and to uh, send me over to other ladies that, that are interested. And I'm really here for you all, but I'm here mostly for my older women. I'm 48 years old. And I find that we, as being older, we forget about ourselves so much. Because we have family, grandchildren, jobs, houses, husbands, men, women, whatever. We have all of that. And we're trying to maintain everything. And you know, we forget about how we feel and how we're looking. 